Okay, let's go for the main line, e4, c6, d4, d5. So it can be knight c3 or knight b2, doesn't matter. So we are taking on e4, knight takes c4. So here are knight f6, knight d7, and bishop f5. But bishop f5 is a main, and we will go for bishop f5. Knight g3, tagging the bishop, bishop g6, and h4. This is all we know this line h6, knight f3, and here I think mostly people, so everyone, uh, let's say, know the line with at d7, h5, bishop h7, bishop d3, but I prefer to play with e6 here, knight d5, bishop h7. So some years ago, this line was showed like it's not, not very good one, but now with these new computers and new ideas, it looks like fine. So let's check it together now. Bishop d3. Uh, we have to take on d2. Yeah, we have to take on d3 because queen d4 is not working because of knight f7, king f7, bishop g6 check. We are losing the queen. So bishop d3, bishop d3, queen takes d3, knight d7. And here I have checked several options. So let's go. Okay, let's start with probably bishop f4. Bishop f4. Here we are going queen a5 check c3 knight d5 bishop takes e5 knight f6 short castle knight g4 rook a d1 knight e5 d e5 rook d8 take 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 check king c7 and here i have checked let's say and knight h5 and rook d3 but it's still holdable, so this can be one of the ideas. Usually, people who are playing with white, they are not going for this line because they want uh, something more, something interesting, and they are trying also f4. Let's go f4, uh, which is probably the one of the main lines here. Bishop e7, bishop d2, knight e5, f takes e5, bishop takes h4, long castle, bishop g3, queen takes g3, knight e7, queen g7, rook g8, queen h6, queen d5, Many, many games are here. King b1, also bishop g5 is possible here. a2, c3, rook g6, queen h5, king d7, g4, rook a g8, bishop b7, king e7 with equality. Always queen a1, queen a4, some checks are coming here. So now king b1, queen g2, bishop g5, knight f5, sorry, bishop b4, bishop g5, we will just take queen g5 and piece down. Bishop b4, knight f5, Queen f6, queen g7, queen g7, knight takes g7, rook d g1, long castle, c3, knight f5, take, take, rook h7, check, king c2, check, king b3, and rook g3, king a4, rook g2, bishop a3, and rook g7, rook a8, check, king c7, rook a8, and crazy strong move b6, rook a7, king b8, and here some interesting draw with king b8 and king c8. So this line, when I saw it first time, and there are many strong players who played these lines, I thought this is something crazy. And then I start to analyze something else. I tried to find f4 was the main option for the long time. And every strong player wants to find here something. They played, played, and I believe one day they just stopped this because it's really very hard to find something. So maybe you can find some ideas and ask us to, to discuss something together. And I want to show you the last thing here, which is, I believe it's really interesting and maybe games should go for this. This is the queen e2 move, knight g f6 and bishop d2, bishop e7, long castle, short castle and king b1. This is goes for some typical Karokan moves, uh, Karokan ideas, and I believe it's, it's quite interesting. So you can, you can check it, uh, as well. Also, I forget to tell that 11th move, there is also option knight d7, queen d7, bishop f4, knight f6, long castle, bishop d6, bishop e5, and long castle here. This should be should be equal for, should be fine for black. So now we will go for 
e4, c6, and these two knights, or Bobby Fischer or the Fed of Tali, both these world champions like this line. And also myself, uh, I have played many games here, and I like the line a lot. So now let's go here, uh, and here we choose the line bishop g4, h3, which is the pop popular line. Bishop h5 is a little bit dangerous, and I really don't don't want you to play this because okay, I will show I can show you shortly what can happen uh, here, which I don't like a lot. So let's go e d5, c d5, g4, bishop g6, check. Some 95. It's not lost or something, but at least it's not the position what uh, what I want you to play. So bishop f3, queen takes f3. I remember even uh, there is a one crazy game we played Tal. He took g takes f3, which is I believe it's just a bad move. But Tal played g takes f3 against Botrini. The problem was he couldn't break the position after queen f3 several times, and then like it was desperation. It's right to f3, so he was. About lost, but if I'm not mistaken, then maybe you can check. Uh, so they uh, end a draw, but uh, but not the thing that uh, should be done. So queen f3, knight, queen f3, knight, f. Okay, so here uh, d3 or d4? This is the question d3 or d4. So let's go with d4 at first. It takes e4. And here e3 is uh, quite interesting because if Knight e4 after queen d4, it's it's really hard to find some compensation. Bishop d3, knight takes e4, bishop takes e4, knight d7, and short castle queen f6. So here I couldn't manage to find any compensation for the pawn, but you can try and if you will have any ideas, you can write in the comments and maybe we can just check it one more time together. So queen e3 is the most interesting idea here. So we are playing knight bd7, knight d4, and we are going to this famous structure, which, okay, let's say like this. So it's evaluate like plus equal. I played even with white, but once even I was managed to lose this position in 20 move with white because there is coming some moment that you don't know how to break the position. It's really very hard to break the black position. It's too solid. And you want to do some crazy thing and it's easier to lose with white. And with blacks, we are just simply waiting. Bishop e7, short castle. We can play a5 at some moment. We can play g6. We can play knight d7, bishop f6, queen b6. Rooks on c8, d8, just waiting position. And it's really very hard to break this position. Because of this, I believe, instead of d4, here d3 is much better move. e6, so here I have checked several options. g3 is a move, g4 is a move, a3 is a move, so let's go with g3. So if g3, I have checked bishop b4, bishop d2, d4, knight b1, and queen b6. I believe here black are doing really fine. I can't see what should white have. So they have two bishops, but I want to take on d2, take on b2, c2, assemble. All positions hanging here. And if g4 instead of c3, so again bishop b4. And if bishop d2, you know the idea, d4 and the queen b6, which is here much better. So I have tried to check a3, but here we are taking on c3 and trying to play queen a5, bishop d2, d5, d4, d4, and knight a6. So here, with this power structure, should be okay for black because it's c2 and here g4, so it's more or less, more or less okay for black. And now on e6, I have, even I, I think I have played a3 with myself because I don't like what blacks are playing bishop b4, so I tried a3, knight bd7, g3, bishop c5, bishop g2, short castle, short castle, and here really one strong move, bishop d4, which is just a team move in this position. If you go knight e2, I can take d4, d4, and then back bishop bb6. If you go queen e2, I'm playing a5, d5, queen b6, and a4, b4. So bishop on d4 is quite strong. I think you can check some games and if you have any questions, uh, I can ask because after bishop d4, I have checked this position several times. I have tried to find something with white, but really it's very hard. White bones are on light squares and we give away the light square bishop. So 
all this like I mean we did classic in we did in classical way. So we give away bishop and we put the pawns on the same squares. So hey, check this video out to make sure that you get more important information to bring your chest to the next level.